Hello everybody, it's Pineapple here, back with another video. And so today I wanted to talk about specifically Master Duel and what's happening in the format there and the ban list that just dropped because uh, I think it's atrocious, I think it's a unholy abomination that we should kill with fire and I think it's uh, incredibly disrespectful to the player base to see a ban list like this um, that does not address anything, um, blatantly like insults its player base um, with some of these hits. Um, it, it boggles the mind. Um, it makes the game more frustrating to play, and uh, I'm not in favor of it. Uh, but we're going to break down exactly why I think all of these hits, minus uh, one or two, is just really, really stupid, um, and why I vehemently disagree with it. Uh, we'll start with just the limited stuff, of course. Uh, Runic Fountain to one, I actually think is a good hit, so we'll get the one good thing that I like on this ban list out of the way, uh, and that is Fountain to one. I think the problem with Runic decks is usually when you resolve Fountain more than once in a turn, um, and limiting it to one, you know, resolves that issue. If you errata it to, say, have a hard once per turn, then you can have it at three, don't really care, but, um, you know, limiting it to one, I guess, is fine. Deck dies to Cosmic Cyclone now, you probably won't see it anymore. Uh, good riddance, um, I, I'm not a big fan of Runic and Runic variants, um, and the most insulting hit on this list is, of course, of course, Math Mech Diameter. Uh, while I am aware that a lot of Math Mech lists like to run multiple copies of this card, uh, two to three, uh, specifically for follow-up, uh, limiting it to one just does not address the problem card of Math Mech, which is so clearly circular. Like, that deck was terrible uh, before circular arrived. Deck got circular, became meta-relevant. Um, and the problem card is clearly circular. That card does too much. Um, there's no doubt that anyone has in its mind that circular is the problem card. We limited it to one on the TCG, and the deck evaporated uh, faster than you can blink. Um, it just limit circular. Uh, it's fine if it's searchable. Um, it's not fine when you open it with four hand traps. Uh, the problem is always when you open circular four hand traps. Um, obviously, like you know, you're not always going to open four hand traps. You're going to open you know, maybe some other names, but uh, the problem with Math Mech is when you open four hand traps and circular. Um, and diameter is not the problem, the follow-up issue is not the bad part of Math Mech. I would actually prefer Math Mech to have more follow-up instead of just being a deck that aims to do one of two things, which is update access code or um, proceed to make a bunch of negates um, and draw two cards with, um, of course, uh, uh, Heat Soul, um, and then maybe spit out another negate with uh, the Terahertz. Uh, but seriously, though, uh, th this hit is just, it, it boggles the mind. It's clearly a, we don't want to give back UR dust, but then they decided to semi-limit sem se INET mining. So why did you go for diameter instead of, like, I don't know, circular? Uh, instead, you're just hurting all cyber decks instead of, you know, just um, Math Mech, which is clearly the only problematic cyber deck right now. Um... Obviously, the Adagnister variant exists, I guess, but, like, do we care about Adagnister? Is that is that really a big concern right now? Um, and, and so you have taken Circular from nine copies with Small World and Mining down to eight copies with uh, Small World and Mining. Um, just, wow, great, great change, guys. Um, can't, so happy to see Signet Mining go to two. Like, what a, what a big change. Tempest to two. Uh, this could have happened forever ago. Um, good riddance. Like, like, put the dragon rulers to three. Like, can we stop pretending these cards are broken? Um, yeah. Uh, for those of you who enjoy Kashdira with uh, like the pile variants with like pile on dragon and stuff, like, good for you. Um, you know, now you have two copies of Tempest. Uh, that's great. Good for you. Um, Pot of Desires to two. Um, th this is whatever. They're they're clearly hitting all of the pot cards. Uh, I, I'm, I think the pot cards are stupid and unfun and, you know, shouldn't exist, but, um, you know, that, that's whatever. Um, I don't, I think Desires is definitely the least problematic of all of the pot cards, but, um, you know, if you want to put it to two, uh, that's fine. I guess if you want to hit Sword Soul, whatever. Uh, quick launch to two. Um, the problem card in Dragon Link is, uh, Chaos Ruler. We all know this. We have established this a thousand times. Um, the deck has fallen into uh, Rogue to Middling Contention Tier 2 or so when you remove Chaos Ruler from its existence. Um, after you remove Chaos Ruler, then you have to start making these weird consistency hits, uh, I feel like, because that deck is just dragging good stuff. Um, so if Chaos Ruler was banned, I wouldn't mind Quick Launch to 2 or Chaos Base to 2 because that, you know, limits the consistency, which is ultimately how you kind of have to hit Dragon Link. It's the exception, not the rule. Um, but... Um, seriously though, uh, wh why is Chaos Ruler still legal? Like, we don't need to be hitting Quick Launch or Chaos Space yet. The problem card is Chaos Ruler. 
Um, it's so clearly Chaos Ruler, and uh, those of you who can't see it, uh, that's a lot of copium. I guess if you want to keep something like Punk Theory in legal, uh, I guess that's a reason. Uh, for pearly hits, they're semi-limiting pearly and uh, delicious, uh, but like, why not just limit delicious instead of, you know, semi-limiting it? Like, come on, like, this deck is so clearly the best deck in the format, like, just make the, like, the right hit and just put delicious to two, please. Um... Pearly to two is actually really interesting, I think, because now your Pearly's, like, missing is, like, actually kind of a really big deal. Um, I actually like this hit, that hit specifically a lot, but a Delicious to two, like, come on, man. Like, just make a, like, real hit and put it to one. Um, like, like, come on. Um, like, what are we doing? Uh, but the Pearly hit, I do think, is actually really interesting because it doesn't ultimately change a whole lot. But, um, if your Pearly's miss, like, it can be disastrous. Um, but I think that's, I think that's actually kind of an interesting hit. Um, it's not a disaster, but, um, like, come on, we want to see more in a pearly, like, they're not even at full power yet, they don't even have Baby Noir, like, come on, man. Uh, Stovey to two, um, the, the, no one has ever thought that any of the Labyrinth engine has ever been the problem. Uh, the problem with Labyrinth is Dimensional Barrier, Eradicator Epidemic Virus, um, Different Dimension Ground, um, all the stupid normal traps that should never have existed in the first place. Uh, Stovey is not the problem, but, like, if you want to ruin, like, what makes Lab cool, which is the fact that it's a super fast trap deck that can play going second, um, sure, I, I guess that's something you can do. Um, I I'm not happy about this hit, but I'm not losing any sleep over it. Um, Stovey to 2 does not change anything for Lab, it's just slightly less consistent, and therefore, you know, you're going to open a hand that are just unplayable more often. Uh, you can supplement this by just playing a third copy of Welcome, I guess. Um, I'm not a big fan of that, but, uh, well, I'll probably do it just to keep my count even. Uh, but, yeah, this is, like, slightly annoying. We'll what? Just hit the problem cards. Um, no one is going to be crying over the loss of Epidemic Eradicator Virus or Dimensional Barrier. I 100% guarantee you that. Uh, I, I'm telling you this is someone who's played this deck forever. Um, don't hit the engine. Hit the other things. Uh, for Unlimits, uh, dried into three. Um, that, that's cool. I guess you can play Pure Zoo now. Um... I don't think Dryden to 3 changes anything. Uh, most decks were only going to play one Dryden anyways, but um, I guess it's neat that you can play multiple copies of Dryden now. Um, good for you, Zoo players, uh, but Rat is still banned, so um, uh, tough luck, I guess. Um, and then Cobalt Sparrow, I guess Bird Up is now at, what, full power? Um, uh, not happy about that. I don't, I'm not a big fan of Bird Up. Uh, for me personally, my first Locals experience was getting absolutely obliterated by that deck, so uh, not a huge fan of seeing Burn Up back, but um, the deck is ultimately fine, uh, especially with Barrier Statue Band. Simorg has Apex Avian as a target, and that's about it. So, um, yeah, this, this ban list is just, it, it's mind-boggling. Um, it contradicts itself because Diameter is clearly a hit that says, oh, we don't want to give back too much UR dust, but then they, you know, semi-limited sem sign at mining, which is a UR, which is just so weird. Um, yeah, it just screams, we don't want to hit these URs, and to me, that's such a cowardly take. Uh, just give people back UR dust, that's all you gotta do. Uh, but that said, I hope you guys enjoyed this discussion and me just rambling about how much I hate this ban list, because I do deeply he hate this ban list, make no mistake. Um, I think it's cowardly and, you know, very weak and doesn't address the things that make the format frustrating, like Maxi as well, but that's a separate discussion. Uh, but if you did, make sure you guys like and subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.